I can't I can't just pretend that I'm Chinese. Are you talking are you talking about national nationality or are you talking about ethnicity? Like you do know the difference. Yeah. So I got you talking about. So I could go I could go to China and get citizenship. So you're talking about ethnicity? Yes. You don't, don't, in your book, self-identify what your ethnicity is? No. Because no? You don't no. self-identify your ethnicity? So I can't self-identify as a Japanese person because I clearly have no ties to ja Japan. Ethnically. Ethnically. So what is no ties? Tell me what ethnicity is. It's a combination of your genes, culture, Yeah, I'm, I'm shit with definitions. So. Clearly. Yeah, I'm not a dictionary. I'm not a walking dictionary. I know the definition. Yeah, but USJWs, like, these sorts of things. I didn't I fall in love with your, your non SJW. No. No. Like you can keep throwing insults at me. But like, I thought we were supposed to be on a higher level. All right. Anyway, all what I'm saying is. What have you been smoking? I'm a cigarette. So you're on a higher level. I'm on a higher plane. So everything's just seedy with you. Like, seedy? Yeah, you, you, you seedy? keep coming on to me earlier. Oh, oh, fuck oh, fuck oh, fuck oh that, that's a lie. That that's another lie. lie. <laughs> I'll, 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 I had to ask him I if he's an absolute liar. I'll, I'll him, tell you. Are you asking me out? And I'll, you had to clarify and say no. I'll tell the viewers at home. <laughs> He came up to me again. He cannot stay away. I said, what is it with you that you can't stay away from me? Is it my sexual magnetism? And he read into that that I was chatting him up. I had to clarify. It's the, you know, it's that Steve is very modest. That's the thing that the calls other people do. <laughs> Must be. It's the modest. There you go. Yeah, Steve, what do you think about the protest yesterday? Um, I can understand how it happened, but the violence was not called for. It was pretty outrageous. And there were some people there that were clearly only there for a fight. Uh, there were lots of drunk people, lots of football hooligans, uh, you know, flying bottles. Yeah. Uh, you know, moral of the story, kids, is don't let people vandalize monuments, or else you'll get other wastemen trying to take justice into their own hands. And and the wastemen will then continue to piss on and defecate other monuments. Yeah, but okay, the, like look, that, that, that. I know the picture you're talking about. The guy was pissing. The guy was pissing on and defecation. Defecation. This is another word. Okay. I'm sure they with words. I'm sure they probably shat in places. I don't think they do. Do you not think that at least one flash did a public shit yesterday? No, I bet they did. Well, look, I think it's a bit different when people, uh, you know, perfectly in their right mind, I mean, the right mind, they were indoctrinated. When they bash down statues, when they vandalize statues. And on the other side, you got this drunk bastard who goes there and takes a piss of the fence of a monument. I think it's a bit different. I don't think he wanted to desecrate the monument. I think he was just a waste. Okay, but, okay, but it is, the, the difference is the whole palaver that we're having over the defecation of these monuments when it's done for Black Lives Matter. Steve's walking away here. No, he's uh, You're gonna follow me again. <laughs> Go ahead, go ahead. No, it's just, he just Nick Knowles. It's a complaint about Nick Knowles. It's, it's a game of catch. The, 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 the problem is that uh, uh, there's, pro, there's been protests throughout the last decades. There's been dozens of them where those same monuments have been desecrated. And the far right haven't come out and been like, hey, you fucking uh, green, uh, green anti capitalist cunts. How dare you desecrate our monuments? No one did that. You know, there's, there's the Green Movement that put a mohawk on Churchill and like some red blood dripping out of his uh, mouth. Like all sorts of shit. And no, there was no fault, I think, because all white people do. As soon as it's seen as black people desecrating these monuments, yeah, but it was also white it's, people it's throwing down the statue that they threw in the in the river. It's not about white or black. It's about the uh, uh, you know uh, uh, mentality. Exactly. Well, that was do you, know Rome, do you know the Romans? No, no, I'm talking about the, the, the statue of the guy who was yeah, yeah, in the list. Yeah, yeah. In, so the Romans, uh, because they changed emperors so often, they used to 
update, we cycled their uh, monuments. So they had a statue of an emperor, he died. They just chisel away and make it look like the new guy. So this can, this uh, refusal to update our like history and what we want to remember and how we remember it, where we all we all own those monuments, we can all choose to treat them however we like. Graffiti washes off. No, no fascist, no fascist died in the graffiti of those monuments until they got offended by it. Like, offense is taken. Uh, no, first of all, I don't so, agree that you could just uh, go ahead and vandalize monuments, write what you want on them. I completely disagree with that. You can't just do that. And uh, but most importantly to that, you know, the Romans did indeed they did change some statues. They did change, but they changed statues to usually of their princess, somebody who didn't come very long ago. Before it was more of a propaganda move than a historical uh, reference. It was a propaganda. It was propaganda. The Romans were masters of propaganda. No, Look at Julius had... no. Caesar's life. He was the biggest master of propaganda in his life. So they would, they in, like, in, in, in human, they'd have a palace and they'd have like the statue of the emperor yeah. send the show, and then they'd obviously need to replace that. Yeah, of course. And where they, what they gonna, yeah. but they're not going to have like. Then they'd have to like. Then they'd have to go and create like some mausoleum, like, old statues, so which is statue. something. That Sometimes some, they did, yeah. Which is something that someone suggested that we do. Maybe we should. Maybe it's time to take Churchill down or be slain. Why are you going to take Churchill? Because it offends. Like, if it offends people when someone graffitis it, it then surely it, you've got to no, accept. Who does the statue offend? People, black people who are black so people. a, a slave. So is it with? Okay. So it's obviously racist. Churchill. Yeah. Imagine if a statue of Hitler. He was the symbol, the symbol of British resistance to Hitler. Are you really going to take down just a guy that's so black and brown people? The sim symbol of fucking oh. oppression. Exactly. So, if we've got that you conflict, know maybe. Imagine watching your son stop. I so, know what so that. Let's and it's a, you know what I'm mad at? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's just finish this. The biggest man in the world was in Ukraine. Let's just finish this. The whole point. So let's have. So, so if we have this conflict in our society about certain monuments, instead of letting our society fight over that monument, maybe it's time to put that away in a museum or in some like big garden where we can go and visit if you want to. So it's not on centre stage for anyone for, to, to be offended or to, to be embraced. Most people, most people don't want the statue removed. Okay, Why would you know? Most people are either indifferent or they want to and that's the way it is. Yeah, anyone who wanted to stay. I have no evidence. Well, yeah, well, look, I don't need any evidence. What do you mean? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Most people don't want it to be removed. I don't need any evidence. You need, you need, you need, you need, you need, you need to do some kind of an election to see if people actually want the statue removed or not. Okay, you don't just go with mob rule. Okay, and the Bristol one, they did that. Yeah, fucking on, international well, election. Listen, Everybody listen, in the world listen, could vote listen, for it. No, listen, listen, because this ha actually happened in the Bristol. I, I, I know they petitioned for it, they did it all there. Democratically, no, and no, then it was blocked. No, no. So when it gets blocked democratically, so people, no, people's will to take it down, then they just get it into their own hands. Was that election so, only in Bristol? Or was that election worldwide? Yes. Why should it be worldwide? What is China Why got should to do this? Dude, are you really saying that people all around the world should say treat the British statues from this? So I should get a vote on Saudi Arabia's statues that they. I, I should get a say in Saudi Arabia. No, you shouldn't. That's what I'm saying to you. It should not be worldwide. So, Bristol's worldwide. It was worldwide, but it was according to what? Only in Bristol or Great Why Britain Why do you itself? want a statue of a slave in there so bad? Like what? Bro, I don't want what? the Does it give you a boner? Okay, what do you I'll love about why. it so I'll much? I'll tell you why What the I'll fuck do you love about it? I'll tell you it's why. It's a fucking... He, he would have spit in your face if he was here. He didn't give a fuck about you. He's just some guy. Like, I'll tell you why. Do you think you were a racist? I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. Do you want statues of racists? I'll tell you why. Do you want me to say it? Do you want me to tell it? Answer my question. Do you want me to say it or not? Why? He's asking. He's asking you if you're not a racist. Listen to me then. If you listen to me speak. 
I'm listening. Okay, so if you aren't a racist, why do you want society to be filled with statues of racists? Because it's a slippery slope. If you start it's a slippery slope, people. removing racism. You, the you slope. don't want me to no, no, no. answer. Because you your answer is shit, answer. fam. You're, like, you see, we, you see, we've already point off the slope. And say racist, we get, we're getting back racist. off the slope now. This is about getting back off the slope. Slippery slope is the only answer you need. We're the bottom. Do you want any conversation? What's the point of you asking? You don't care about the number shut up. Answer the question. You see, you want me to shut up. You don't want an answer. You don't want an answer. There's no point answering you. I tried to answer. I'm asking you. Answer, bro. Answer, bro. Answer, are you talking to a fucking five year old? Answer, bro! You can escape a fucking mental like I'm, asylum, bro. Why are you just insulting me? Like, because you started what insulting are you talking me. about? You started insulting me. I went. When you called me a racist. I asked you, do you think no, you're a racist? An and you said no. That's just a statement of fact. I asked you, do you think yeah. you're a racist? Statement of fact. And you said I'm a racist no. by fact. I mean, it seems so. It seems so. Okay. So he's insulting me now. Also. Oh. So <laughs> you want to Why do you want statues of slavery if you're not a racist? Because it's fucking history, man. I don't want Julius Caesar's statues to be removed just because he owns slaves. Where are they hidden statues? Hitler statues. Hitler statues are propaganda. You can find Hitler no, statues why in museums. Statues. Yeah, exactly. So yeah. why aren't why aren't others? Why do we think I don't want to walk around my kids? This guy would have called you a nigger. This guy would have called you a nigger. I'm not walking around my kids. What the fuck are you even about? Why do I want to walk around my kids being like this man? What do you mean? What do you mean? If you don't like, you guys, if you don't like, why are you here? Do you not accept? Why am I here? It's the same as with the other guy. If you don't like it, why are you here? Hold on, we come to the country. I came to this country because I like this country. I'm gonna respect what these people I choose to do. My, my parents, my ancestors were slaves, and I'm a refugee, and I was born. So I'm, I'm British. With, with you I didn't come here. Excellent. I, I like was created here. He's British. He's white. Yeah. Why is he yeah. here? If he doesn't mean. like. It. So you're making fun of other country because I like it. But where am I gonna go? I don't know. Some place that you like. You're not even from this fucking country. I'm, I'm not. not. I'm not. not. I know it's not about whether or not you're from the country, you, it's whether or not you like the country, whether or not you respect the country. If you're not gonna that's what it's about. This is no no no, 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 no. this is my fucking country. This you don't like it. This what you're Ukraine was my fucking country. Ukraine was my fucking country. I don't care country. if I'm brown. I left. It doesn't matter country. if you're brown. It doesn't matter what matters. Everyone here, they're standing in my fucking country with me. Do you ever criticize your family of when they do something? I do. So are you allowed to criticize your country Absolutely. as well? Absolutely, you're allowed to criticize. So what is your problem with people criticizing their country? It's not about criticizing. About vandalizing, about destroying statues, about taking more room. That's okay. what I'm against. So, so when when the democratic system, let's get this back to the facts that we're talking about. When the democratic system of Bristol says that we want this statue, that we want the statue taken down, and then it gets more democratic process. It was a democratic process. It was a democratic. The police stood back and did what? And the chief constable of Brother Haven Police. That was after the democratic the process. Secretary. You're not listening. It was more. That did the fact that after the democratic process, oh, so we want failed. mob rule. Steve. We want mob rule to hold on. Steve, you have to fucking stand up with a statue of a guy who didn't give a fuck about it. That's your fucking life. Do you know about if you've been to Bristol? He didn't give a fuck. Steve, you obviously don't know about Bristol. Steve, you obviously don't know about Bristol. They tried to democratically. The main theatre, the school, the road, the public building, the Colston is throughout Bristol. If you've ever been to Bristol, you know anything about Bristol. Democratic mandate to bring that statue down, so why did and, then they, rule and then they could it block, so, some people blocked it. I can't remember the details, but it got blocked after they had the so democratic mandate. You're happy mandate. with mob rules? When, the de when democracy fails, yes. It's always linked to I mean, these guys like the country.